When truth controls the life, September 29th. He that followeth me shall not walk in darkness, but shall have the light of life. John 8 verse 12. The Lord Jesus took upon him the form of sinful man, clothing his divinity with humanity. But he was holy, even as God is holy. If he had not been without spot or stain of sin, he could not have been the saviour of mankind. He was a sin-bearer, needing no atonement. One with God in purity and holiness of character, he could make a propitiation for the sins of the whole world. Christ is the light of the world. Through him light is shining amid moral darkness. If he were not light, the darkness would not be apparent, because light reveals darkness. The clearer the light, the more manifest the contrast between light and darkness. Let the light be removed, and there is naught but darkness. Christ has declared our possession. He that followeth me shall not walk in darkness, but shall have the light of life. John 8 verse 12. He is himself the bright and morning star. He is the sun of righteousness, the brightness of his Father's glory. He is the true light which lighteth every man that cometh into the world. A physician, a healer, he came to restore the moral image of God that was lost by transgression. When Christ abides in the soul by faith, he makes the one who loves him all light in the Lord. It is true that many who say they believe the truth have only a nominal faith. They are not doers of the word. They profess to believe, but their profession will not convert them. When Christ dwells in the heart, his presence is apparent. Good and pleasant words and actions reveal the Spirit of Christ. Sweetness of temper is manifested. There is no angry passion, no obstinacy, no evil surmising. There is no hatred in the heart because ideas and methods are not accepted and appreciated by others. When the truth controls the life, there is purity and freedom from sin. The glory, the fullness, the completeness of the gospel plan is fulfilled in the life. The light of truth irradiates the soul temple. The understanding takes hold of Christ.